Hello guys and girls, Voices from the Dark here. Let's go to church. I don't know if it's Sunday where you're watching, but... There's something going on. There's cops here. We know that Joy and Iris were at the church, and things are just going down and not looking good. So let's press the left mouse button. Cops and criminals get used to red and blue flashing lights. Even after you get numb to them, sometimes they still chill your bones. You can get that feeling that this time, they mean something personal. Thank God you're okay. No, no, Joy, Joy, don't! Damn it. Lieutenant, caught her sneaking up the side staircase. Says she's a friend of the priest. Where's Walter McCauley? Is he all right? Just put her in my car. I want to interview her myself. Can somebody remind Broyles that the door's not gonna watch itself? Yes, sir. It's a simple question, please! Take it easy on her. Hey, anybody find Baxter yet? Nope. Into the station, drove by his place, nothing. You know, there's definitely something wrong here. I mean, honestly, have you ever seen anything like this? <laughs> After this stuff, it feels like a goddamn riddle. I don't know. I just seem so demented. Demented? I gotta find this crime scene before they cart away all the evidence. Find out what happened at the church. I need to make sure they're okay. Let's begin the investigation. <gasps> oh, I forgot about that one too. Okay. Okay. Oh, screw this. Okay, okay. Looks like we can get an easy kill like this. We need to make sure nobody's watching. I can't do it. That guy's coming, he's doing the sexy walk. Go! I misclicked. It's, it's kinda tricky. Go, 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 go. Go! Okay, I think going up here is a good way to lose them. Because up here I can also do like, um, sneak attacks, like I can come flying down and surprise them. Right, one, two, three. I'm not sure if I actually have to take them out. I might just... Oh, I should, shouldn't I? Oh my god, there's so many of them. Oh, fuck. F my life. Alright. One of them is over there. Yeah. Hey, baby! Yes, gotcha. Death from above. Do 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 Now this one's gonna be tricky because these two people they they like to chill. They're besties. So <sighs> Okay. Just gotta wait and see if one of them turns their backs. I want to try and take out the guy in the middle, since it's much easier teleporting to him. I should not teleport forwards here, I just feel, because, like, he's probably gonna... There must be a moment. Now would be a good time. Turn around. Yes! Gotcha. Okay. Now I have you, you... Bastard. 
We're actually gonna go upstairs and I wanna get a sneak attack on him. Gotta use the advantage, you know? When you have it. Alright, Mr. Ghosty. Good day. And good night. Takes me a few seconds of like brain power to figure out where my fingers should be. Maybe it would be better to just look, but nah. Where's the fun in looking? So if you didn't get all the uh, the banshee things the first time around, you can actually get them now. Nothing sacred to this guy. Nope. The work of a real monster. Yep. Oh, I guess it was nothing. Let me just walk over this pit of imminent doom, and we will be fine. Oh. Whoa, whoa, frame rate, dude. Please, be like that. I'm getting somewhere. I can't stop now. I wasn't gonna stop, I wanted to go out here. Killer's trail here. Well, crushed to death from statue stones. Uh, I'm guessing that was an accidental death or suicide. So improvised weapon. Weapon. Hospital, she'd still be alive. Don't hold too tight to what's keeping you here. Just remember, this wasn't your fault. I'm sorry. Goodbye, Ghost Rider. What else did he do here? Hmm. Interesting, because this is not the only crime scene here, you see? There's more to it than that, and this door is locked now. That door is locked, and I don't have my kitty cat. So let's go this way then. Hey, Mr. Copperoni. Nothing sacred to this guy. I know, you had the exact same thoughts as the guy over there. Hey, kids. Hey guys, what's up? Oh shit. Oh man. This was a party I missed out on. Whoa, hey guys. It's one heck of a party. Well, falling, scared, needs help. Hmm. Iris was fleeing. He stumbled through the group of people apparently fleeing from somewhere else. Why did Iris get to go to the party but I didn't? Unfair. Twisted. Bum bum bum. No chance. Well beaten. What about this guy? Like he probably did a backflip or something. That's awesome. Yeah, severely overpowered. Still have food though. That looks like a very good dot PNG image. Hmm. Could go for some hey, of that PNG. Still with us? You, you just stop talking. 
Hey, sup, girl. Let's see, let's influence you. Oh my god, a just married party thing. It's bad. What would make her think about why the killer murdered them? Uh, Iris fleeing? That girl was running away. That's who he's after. Not the rest of us. The witness claims the killer was obviously after Iris and they got in his way, so he killed them. That's pretty... That's pretty harsh. We have cocktails already. Okay, alright everyone, let's get this picture. We've got to get to the reception now. Everybody... Please, let me through! Oh my god! 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 Oh my god!
he was interrupted, which led to the father dying, and then the cat. It is the cat! It is always the cat. Right, it's probably the drop photo then. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think she's the most ideal roommate. No, no rough around the edges, but I'm sure you like the room, and in time you'll both get along really well. Don't worry, I can get along with most anyone. Excellent. Well, this is the room. Here we are. Father? What's wrong? Go! Go! <gasps> Came here looking for joy, but took out Iris instead. This is a friggin' dead end. So where's Baxter? If he's not here, he's got some explaining to do. Well, what about you? You see anything? Hmm? Hmm. Hello, kitty. Where you go? What? Where did? What? You were, but uh... easy, kitty. Easy, easy. It's your old buddy Ronan. What the hell was that? The killer dropped something in the vent. Maybe the cat can help get to it. Alright, kitty. You're up. Killer dropped the item. Cat is gonna get it. Come on. There we go. Stupid kitty. Thanks for the help. Alright. Check this key out. Oh, the key. I know that house. It's Judgment House. That's it. The killer's hideout. I need to get to Judgment House. Dun, dun, dun. All right, complete. And I didn't investigate the Bell Killer's hideout. The Old Judgment House might be where the Bell Killer is right now. Dun dun dun. Of course. We're gonna have a final little spirit down here. It's just gonna be a pain for us, but it's fine. I can deal with that. Go! I can't move for some reason. Oh no, oh no, oh. Okay. So what I said earlier about we're not gonna revisit another place again, I kinda forget about that. We are, actually. So yeah. But, but. There we go! That should be all though. Let's let's try and get out of here now. All right, let's go to Judgment House. It's gonna get creepy. this way. The killer was right. after you. Oh. What happened in there? He didn't suffer. You're lying. He died protecting innocent people. That's all you need to know. He died because of me. Hey. <laughs> you 
Now, pleading insanity isn't going to help you much on two counts of trespassing and felony escape. So you can drop the crazy act, all right? Rex, man, give her a break. You have anything to say for yourself? No? That's what I thought. We'll figure out what to do with you at the station. Why does this keep happening to Joy, me? Joy, tell him what we found. They need to know it all. You gotta find a way to convince him. Where are you going? Killer left a clue about the ancient mansion we saw at the museum. Tell Rex about that too. It's probably the killer's place. Okay, I'll try. Alright, Joy safe in custody, and we can go to the Judgment House. But why walk when you can use the powers of teleporting combined with editing? There we go, here's Judgment House. Let's go. I always heard this place was such an interesting museum back in its heyday. Now it's just a place propped up by rusty nails and rumors. Place you wouldn't dare your worst enemy to go into. All right, there it is, Judgment House. Huh? Maybe this abandoned place isn't so abandoned after all. I hate it when I'm right. Cop car outside. Alright. Time to go check out that room with the lights on. Now this is actually a place where I don't... I can't remember finding the story. I think me and Eve kind of ran out of time and... We wanted to do other things together so we kind of just, you know, said... Ah, let's just go to the final encounter. So this is going to be interesting. Now we can both find that story. Ashes to ashes. So let us... Check this out. Poem 1. She who does the devil's dance, he'll drop and crack and sway, and jig upon the rope perchance, the devil's dues to pay. Yes, I'm gonna have some beautiful, beautiful poems. Let's go through here. Yeah. What's this? Life and after. I asked Ronan today if he believed we go on after we die. He wondered if I meant like heaven or like ghosts. I told him I meant ghosts, and he just laughed and didn't say anything. I'm gonna take that as a no. Yeah, totally. Ghosts. They don't exist. I actually don't believe in ghosts. But that's probably just because I've not had anything supernatural happen to me. Yet, other than the supernatural sexiness of my hair. Uh, that can't be explained. A natural bridge of ghost and flesh, you harvest souls as though a friend. You cut with scythe with pitchfork thresh until you meet your righteous ends. Lovely. Lovely things. Judgment House, where so many witches have been judged in the past. This has to be a good place to, uh, to search. Especially if there's a cop in here. The only cop I could think about is Baxter right now. Huh. Let's... Let's go see how that goes. This house is not kind on frame rate. It really is not. This game in general... I didn't have any issues when I played with Eve, but it looks like my own computer is not really handling it too well, which... is kind of a shame, but I think it's still been an overall good experience. We're slowly getting closer to the end of the game. It's not a terribly long game, but I kind of like the length. I don't like games that drag on for too long. Let man beware who keeps so foul a witch from a harm beneath his wing. She casts her spell upon his soul 
Rick's damnation's reckoning. His wing reckoning? You're kind of stretching it there. Okay. That's fine. So that's the room we want to go, so let's go into the other room. Looks good. Alright. Hey, people. Alright, let's go. Whoa. Another poem. To rid the land of nature's guilt through exercise of power requires more vigil... <clears throat> To rid the land of nature's guilt through exercise of power requires more vigilance than thou wilt. Tis always judgment hour. Alright. Thank you for the info. This was actually not the place we were supposed to. There we go. Holy shit. Look at all this crap. This is... Oh, fresh paint. This one's just been done. The witch who flew from her own mother, herself a witch, herself in flight. She'll meet her death like so many other, and leave both realms this very night. Oh no, that's about joy. This looks like the Bell Killer's war room. I should check this all out. Scour this room for information about the Bell Killer. Okie dokie. Can do. The devil made me do it. Major Stutter deflects blame after being charged with a series of torturous murders. Old Salem murders. There were torturous killings in Salem over a hundred years ago. Can't just blame it on the devil. There you go. Map of the previous killings. This map shows the locations of all of his murders, but in far more detail than the police know. Damn. Personal items. Trophies? Victims and murder methods. Damn. I see Sophia here. I see a lot of people. I think I see Iris too there. Or Rose, rather. He probably hasn't had time to put up Iris. Third hanging victim discovered. Bizarre hangings and three recent murders harken back to Salem's shameful past. This was 40 years after the other newspaper. So there's still similarities. Alright, let's conclude. Wait, 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 wait. Similar murders. Multiple killers. Decades apart. Is this a string of copycats? A conspiracy? What else did you hide in this house, you freak? What was that? Well, I know what that is. Those are demons. And I'm gonna say nope. I'm gonna say nope. Just wanna quickly check if there's anything I missed out here. It all looks good. Everything is good. Okay. Let's go have some ghost battles. Just three of them. Should be fine. Alright, this is a safe room. You gotta figure out where all the walls are. Go, go, go. Thank you. Thought I was stuck there. Although I need to get around the ghost somehow. Or a demon, I keep saying ghost. Don't you want to check that out? Oh. It's right outside. Go! Gotcha! Alrighty, yo, so. Good work. Alright, two more of them. The reason I'm being so careful with collecting here is because I've never actually managed to get them all. So I gotta keep an open eye if I wish to get the creepy story in the end. But I think that was it for now. It gets kind of confusing when you walk through a lot of doors. It's like I don't even know him, and I felt so close, but to a man in my imagination. I would think that something like a criminal record should really come up earlier in a relationship, 
It's not even his past that is keeping me away now, it's that he didn't tell me right away. He said his tattoos made it obvious, but I don't know, not obvious enough, I guess. It might be too late for us. Well, obviously it wasn't. Let's go downstairs, because everybody knows that that's where the good stuff happens, right? Oh yes, oh yes. Alright, the plaque. I don't really want to read that. <laughs> Ooh, money! Ka-ching, ka-ching! Money! Ka-ching, ka-ching! What else is new? Ooh. There's something in here. Ooh, yeah. There we go. Sometimes a man can be an insensitive beast. I know he's got pressures at work, but home is the place where you let go of all those things. It'll be better tomorrow, I know, but for now, I'm done thinking about it. Just gonna write a mental note and leave it in this abandoned house. That'll make me feel better. <laughs> Okie dokie. Let's... Move along, ghosties. Never mind. This place I actually struggle with a little bit. It's kind of tricky. Can I go through the fireplace here? No, I can't. Can I go through the walls? No. Could have been a good shortcut to get to them. Cause there's four of them. I think this is the biggest gathering of demons that you have to ever fight, so this is sort of the final demon challenge. Okay. So there's a crow there which I would like to alert. And then I gotta hide quickly. And we gotta be patient, wait for one of the demons to be distracted, wait for the other one to turn around, hopefully do the combination correctly. That's always a plus. Stop hiccuping. That's another thing I gotta do. Well, there we go. Uh, 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 uh. Got him. Okay, now this ghost in here should... Demon should be a little easier. Oh, damn. Gotta hate demons. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. Alright, now there's two more and they're both in that room in there. Trials were held in this room. Judge's Diary. Alright, we got all the witch trials. February 4th, 1693. The witches were all released and Governor Phipps will not permit further prosecution. Yet it is this girl I fear most. I did threaten her with pressing and with glee she did tell me of, what, of the tortures of her own father, who pressed and ducked her onto drowning, which did not accuse his enemies. So I am not the first man to use this creature and she is not afraid of my rebukes. Those who see the spirits of a natural world are as conjurers to her. She will not be dissuaded in the pursuit of them. She must be destro destroyed by any available means of the law. Really? So apparently there was this um, person who really wanted uh, all the spiritual people dead. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Oh, there is a little raven here. Can I just have a quick peek? Okay. I did not go as planned. I was gonna do something else there, but uh, the, the plan kind of just changed. All right, so now we gotta play the uh, the waiting game, the best kind of game. Can't think of a funner game, really. That's the problem with like uh, stealth in games. So I don't know if this is really this isn't really stealth. It's more patient waiting before bursting through a wall and saying boo, and then exercising the demons. Isn't that right, Mr. Crow? Yes, I know you feel it. What? But he was distracted! No, that is bollocks. Oh, good. Like, he's come with me through here before. Like, I've been running up the stairs and he's still been after me. I think the crow stopped crowing. I don't I know it's not called crowing, but bear with me here. I think it stopped crowing just as he was about to, uh, go to it. So that kind of sucked. Ugh, this is gonna... I gotta wait again. There 
There we go. And I'm out of here. Okay, one more, one more. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. There's no escape from the dark side. Good thing I didn't go through there. He's coming right this way. Turn. God, it's creepy being near them because of the sound effects. Yeah. Good. Alright, that should be most demons. Most demons taken care of. Good, good, good. Alright, let's check out some of the rooms here for some uh, goodies. And also, like, the collectible notes in this game, they aren't all useless either, because you can find some pretty vital clues to the storyline. What stopped me from saying yes to Ronan? Maybe it's marriage in general. I always thought I'd just be an independent woman in this world. Huh, I may not have preceded this possibility enough, but I can't let him go. Can't. How can you be an independent woman when you got a man with this much swagger? I don't get it. I don't get it. Looks like that was most of the things here. No collectibles, though. That makes me a sad boy. What about this door? And this. There we go. Kaching money. And we can't go here. Okay. Five more. Although the level's soon over, so. Let's go further down. Hopefully, find good things and not bad things, because that would be bad. Oh my god, Baxter? I should have been the one that stopped you. Ronan? What the hell is going on? You sick bastard. Why'd you do it? Why'd you bring back the witch trials and kill all those innocent girls? You think I'm the bell killer? Are you, are you insane? I've never killed anyone. You gotta help me. What is this place? We gotta get out of here. Oh, we gotta get out of here. All of a sudden, we're buds. Uh, uh, uh. You need to tell me what's going on here. Who killed you? I'm... Oh, two, not three. So, who killed you? The bell killer, you idiot. But I didn't get a good look at his face. Where's the killer? Where's the killer? No idea. He could be anywhere, but when we fought, he said something I didn't understand at all. Wait, 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 wait. The killer actually talked? Not much, but I think I hit a nerve. I told that bastard he'd be dead soon, but he said, I already know death. And then something about his instrument of death will kill again tonight. My instrument of death? But he kills different ways every time. I don't, I don't get it. Yeah, me neither. We gotta figure out what that means. I know what it means. <laughs> what were you doing here? What were you doing here? Following a lead. I never dropped the case. Had this psychic, Cassandra, working with me. And we figured out the bell killer is hunting mediums. Like a witch trial execution copycat. At that point, we couldn't let it go. Even after Rex demoted me. So that's why you're at the museum. Where's Cassandra? Do you know where Cassandra is? Is she still alive? Last I checked, yeah. I took her to a safe house outside of town. Oh my god, she's alive. I was sure she'd be dead too. Joy would be freaking ecstatic. She shouldn't end up alone. Do you know Joy? Sandra ever bring up her daughter? Wouldn't shut up about her. We looked for Joy for days, but it was too risky. Cassandra has been begging me to track Joy down, but I haven't found her yet. You're not gonna believe this. Joy's been helping me tonight. <laughs> Figures a cop like you would need help to get this far. Uh, you mean like what? The help you got from her mom? Alright, you get back to Cassandra. Make sure she's still safe and bring her back to the station. What are we gonna do? I'm going to quickly check out the cellar and come up with a plan. I hope. Alright. Gotta check out the cellar. And needless to say, 
I'm gonna figure out something dark and dangerous down there. But I feel like I should end the episode here. We only have 15 minutes left. I don't know if that's enough to kind of wrap this up. So tune in for the next episode, which is also going to be the final episode. So hopefully you're going to tune in then and we can figure out who the bell killer is. And everything will be glorious. Have a still good day, take care and stay awesome. But most importantly, everybody, stay dark. Goodbye. <laughs>